friends, uh, I'm Parwiz and this is our 14th video in PyTutor 5 GUI programming with Python 3. In previous video, we have covered uh, context menus in uh, PyQt5 and today we are going to uh, cover toolbars in PyQt5. Okay, now let's get started. First of all, I make a new Python file. Uh, I call it uh, toolbars like this and like previous videos, I copy my window code and paste it in my toolbar okay now if I run this I will have a simple and nice window and also I want to change the the title to PyQt5 toolbars okay uh, now the first thing you need you need to import uh, we need an import in here uh, to import the first one is uh, Q action and the second one is in here uh, from pyqt 5qtgui import q icon like this okay now in this section in the nf init video uh, first of all you should uh, make a exit action exit action q action uh, if you don't know about Q action, you can watch the previous video. I have uh, uh, described the Q action in the, in that video. Okay. Uh, now give it a Q icon, and it needs uh, some parameters. The first one is you should give the icon name. I have some icons in here. Uh, the first one I want to add the exit exit dot png and uh, name it exit and self okay uh, now make a short shortcut for this exit act dot set shortcut uh, I <coughs> I give it uh, control control plus Q okay and also let me make it like uh, plus plus like this Control plus Q, and uh, after that, uh, I want to make another uh, open act uh, Q action Q icon, and uh, I have uh, an open icon. Uh, I think I have in here. Uh, save. Uh, I can exit delete okay I give this uh, not open uh, it should be copy <coughs> and give it uh, copy dot png copy and self also you can give the shortcut to this uh, copy act dot set shortcut you can give this uh, for example control plus uh, C okay uh, now we make another button uh, another Q action button mm. paste act Q action uh, Q icon uh, give the icon name paste.png we have uh, paste and also we have a self okay now make a shortcut to this set shortcut uh, I give it a control plus uh, V okay uh, now I want to add uh, delete uh, delete act Q action Q icon I give it uh, it is delete dot uh, png uh, delete 
and also the last one is self okay now give a shortcut to this delete act dot set shortcut or uh, I give it control plus D like this uh, one action button another we want to add uh, that is uh, uh, save I think uh, save act Q action Q icon uh, save dot png save and self okay uh, now um, save act dot set shortcut uh, I give it control plus s plus s okay uh, now these are our Q actions uh, now in here uh, we want to make our toolbar self dot uh, toolbar is uh, self dot at toolbar and give it a name toolbar like this okay now we want to add our every action to the toolbar uh, the first one self dot uh, toolbar sorry serves toolbar dot at action and uh, give it which action the first one is uh, uh, the first one is exit act okay uh, let me copy this uh, another one is copy act copy this uh, paste act mm, delete action and save action like this okay uh, now if I run this You can see that we have uh, a toolbar and also we have uh, these icons. Okay, now you can bring toolbar in here. Uh, you can bring it at the uh, at the top. You can make it in the at the bottom, and also you can make it uh, like this mm, at the left side. Okay. Uh, now this is toolbar. Okay. Uh, now I want to add an action to my this uh, close button. I want to add when I click this, uh, the window should be closed. Okay. Uh, for this, you can define a function in here, method or function. Uh, diff close app. And simply you can sell dot close. Okay. Now make you set your triggers in in the exit in here. Mm, exit act dot uh, triggered dot connect self dot close app. Okay. Now if I run this, first of all check the code from the top. You can see we have window, we have uh, init window, and also we have in here our actions and icons. Uh, we have our toolbars. <coughs> At the end, we have our main loop. Okay. Now, if I run this application, okay, uh, you can see I bring it in here. If you press the close, the application is closed. Yeah. Uh, okay, guys. Uh, thank you. This was our 14th video. If you have any question, uh, please let me know. And also, uh, for the further videos, please subscribe to the channel and also like the video.